Let us turn to the Lord in prayer. Lord, we give you praise for the gift of this day, for the lengthening of the days, for the coming of spring, for the opportunity to worship together, to be with friends and family, to make new friends and be a part of the community of faith. We're grateful for this weekend of spiritual renewal with Matt and Liz Meyer Bolton. We thank you for the rhythm of labor and rest and for the work you have given us to do with our minds and our hands. We pray for those among us who are seeking work and the many in our community who are unemployed and underemployed. We pray for those who are frustrated in their daily labors. May we take the time to rest from our labors so that you may do your holy work in us. Gracious Lord, we pray for the needs of our world and we lift them to you. Help us to see your face in the faces of children in refugee camps and families huddled together in war-torn countries and the elderly alone at home or in health care facilities and the soldiers who long for home and for peace and the children and youth in our schools and to see your face in those with whom we live and work each day. In the faces of the people of many lands in the Middle East, the Ukraine, and Africa, or in the midst of social turmoil, war, and political change. Teach us, O oh God, to see with your eyes, to walk in the way of the cross, to let go of hatred, to love the enemy with your heart, and to serve all with your hands. Gracious Lord, help us to know what is important, how to value the things that endure, acts of kindness and compassion, commitment to justice and peace, caring for the old and the young, witnessing to our faith to those who are in spiritual struggle or pain, sharing our abundance with those in need, caring for this creation, our home in living lives of faithfulness and integrity, embodying your love and service to the world. And so today, we lift in prayer to you in the silence of our hearts those whom we know who are sick, afraid, grieving, in need, and anxious. And so with joy and thanksgiving, we offer these in all prayers in the name of Jesus, who taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. 